Chapter 789 to 8000 Mile Black Swamp Si Chichuan crashed into the Nine Flower Lake, causing ice-cold water to splash into the clear skies. A single spear strike had sent Si Chichuan rocketing into the lake, but Lin Ming was still flying high in the air as if he hadn't used much energy at all. How terrifying. As everyone looked at Lin Ming fluttering high in the air, those several revolving core martial artists that had nearly coughed up blood turned even more pallid. A moment ago, they had felt an irresistibly powerful strength in the aftermath of that collision just now. In truth, they were all inferior to Si Chichuan. Although Si Chichuan was older than they were, his cultivation had still reached the peak of the second stage of life destruction. But at Lin Langian, his age was unknown. Perhaps he might not even be over 26 years of age. His cultivation was only at the late revolving core realm and yet his strength was enough to completely suppress Si Chichuan. This caused them all to feel greatly frustrated and helpless. This simply didn't seem like a talent that a human should possess. It wasn't just the revolving core martial artists that were startled, but the several other princes in the audience were also shocked. Lin Ming would inevitably become one of the highest peak powerhouses of the Sky Spill continent. Such a person would be able to wield near unlimited influence throughout the entire continent in the future. And the most important factor was that he didn't belong to any of the four divine kingdoms or their subordinates. His future possibilities were endless. Bang! The surface of the water erupted as Sichu Chuan shot upwards. At this moment, his face was white and his hair was a ruined mess. His entire body was dripping with water and he was embarrassed beyond being embarrassed. Lin Ming indifferently looked at Sichu Chuan. Sichu Chuan's defensive ability to withstand attacks was too strong. Even though he had been heavily struck twice, his injuries actually weren't heavy at all. However, this was also within reason. The great desolate halberd art had become famous as an offensive battle technique of the demon emperor. But, it originally wasn't used only as an offensive ability, but also a defensive one. The blood drinking seals could be used to attack as well as defend. Si Chichuan had fused blood drinking seals into his protective true essence, causing his protective true essence to surpass common sense. That Si Chichuan is definitely a true master. Although he might be a little weaker than Corbinser, it wasn't by too much. And if he had used that arcane ability to stimulate his bloodline just now then he would even be able to surpass Corbinser. Too bad for him. The one he ran into today is me. Meeting Lin Ming was Si Chichuan's own bad luck. As the saying went, know yourself, know the enemy, and be undefeatable. Lin Ming had already practiced Si Chichuan's great desolate halberd dart for many years now, and the version he studied was far more complete. For instance, all of those moves Si Chichuan used just now like blood seal twisting murder, primeval spear strike, the slaughter path, Lin Ming knew all of those techniques like the back of his hand. There might be no one more clear about the characteristics of blood drinking seals than he was. Before they fought, all of Si Chichuan's techniques had already been thoroughly understood by Lin Ming, how could he still fight? And what was lamentable was that Si Chichuan's two great pillars, the concept of space and the slaughter path, were all completely defeated by Lin Ming, making it so that he couldn't display the true strength of the great desolate halberd art. Then, Si Chichuan's only advantage over Lin Ming was that his cultivation was a realm and a half higher than his. But even so, with the support of his battle spirit, eight inner hidden gates, comprehension of concepts, and many other factors, all of this made it so that Si Chichuan was tyrannically oppressed from start to finish. Originally, Si Chichuan's terrifying defensive power was the reason that he could rank on the destiny decree. However, Defense couldn't be compared to offense. Offense could be used to suppress others, but being better in only defense meant that one would be smacked around a lot longer. And as the battle had continued, Si Chichuan had seemed incomparably distressed as it looked as if he were being slapped around without any strength or resistance. In his current state, Si Chichuan's face violently distorted with anger. He couldn't accept this defeat. He would rather lose a hundred years of his life and admit defeat to Lin Ming. Brother Si Chu, you've lost. Yang Yun rose up and said, Si Chichuan's lips twitched, blue veins popping out on his forehead. Again and again he had lost miserably. Si Chuan could no longer say that he would finish the rest of the ten moves with Lin Ming, and, even though he didn't wish to admit it, continuing this battle would be futile, he would simply be beaten down again, don't fight, the two of us are not his opponent, continuing to fight is just shaming yourself, a true essence sound transmission sounded out in Si Chuan's ears, this message had come from Si Chufeng, this boy obviously understands all of your abilities, he should also have inherited the great desolate halberd art, however, we know nothing about him, all we can see is that there is the shadow of the great desolate halberd art and his techniques, we must report this matter to His Highness the Divine Emperor and allow him to decide what shall be done. Si Chichuan's grim face seemed indecisive. Then, he grit his teeth and slowly fell down from the air. Ten Jin of Million Year Wood Spirit Jade and One Jin of Wood Spirit Jade Quintessence. Lin Ming said, as Si Chichuan and Si Chufeng heard these words, their lips spasmed. Even with their own great net worths, producing these sorts of treasures would still be extremely difficult. I haven't brought those things with me. I can compensate you with Spirit Essence Stones and other things. Si Chichuan said with a dark and gloomy expression. Lin Ming chuckled. Millionaire Wood Spirit Jade and Wood Spirit Jade Quintessence are priceless treasures that cannot be bought. Their value cannot be estimated with mere Spirit Essence Stones. With so many heroic young elites here, there are countless treasures on them. With your status as an Azura Divine Kingdom Prince, borrowing them shouldn't be too difficult. You, Si Chu Chuan's intestines painfully twisted together as he heard Lin Ming's words. Si Chu Feng was afraid he would open his large mouth and say something irreproachably stupid so he stepped forward and said, Since we were willing to make a bet, we are also prepared to lose. Your Highness the Crown Prince, please allow us to borrow your Wood Spirit Jade. There was only one Divine Kingdom Crown Prince present, Yang Yun. The Nine Furnace Divine Kingdom had the richest Wood Spirit Jade resources. 
so he was the only one here capable of easily bringing out ten Jin of Wood Spear Jade and a Jin of Wood Spear Jade Quintessence. Yang Yun smiled as he stood up and said, Everyone here are grand characters of the Sky Spill Continent. For us to all gather here at my Nine Flowers Banquets is also a stroke of destiny. We must not harm our friendships. Since Brother Lin desires Wood Spear Jade, I indeed have some that I may lend to Brother Si Chu. As Yang Yun spoke, he took out a jade box from his spatial ring. The crystal clear and dazzling jade box was only three inches long. After opening it, a brilliant flaming light suddenly bloomed outwards. Yang Yun took out a wood spear jade the size of a quail egg from the jade box. Everyone was startled at the sight of this wood spear jade. The color was an unexpected deep gold. That is wood spear jade quintessence. Even though the martial artists present were extraordinarily wealthy individuals, this was also the first time they had seen the rare wood spear jade quintessence. Yang Yun said, Wood spear jade quintessence is countless times more valuable than common wood spear jade. Don't look at how small this wood spear jade quintessence in my hands is. The truth is that there is already one jin and three tails here. As for the million year wood spear jade, I haven't brought that with me today. After some time I shall go to the kingdom's treasury and select some suitable material for Brother Lin. Lin Ming said, Your Highness Crown Prince is too polite. The extra three tails of this wood spear jade quintessence are far more than enough to make up for ten jin of million year wood spirit jade. Lin Ming had inherited the memories of that realm of the gods alchemist so he had an approximate understanding of the value of wood spear jade. Ha ha. All right then. Yang Yun didn't argue. A blue light surrounded the jade box and the box then slowly flew towards Lin Ming. Lin Ming received the jade box and placed it within his spatial ring. Thank you. Your Highness the Crown Prince, Lin Ming's words were sincerely spoken from the heart. Ever since coming to the Nine Furnace Divine Palace, Lin Ming had a very favorable impression of Yang Yun. Ha ha, the Nine Furnace Divine Kingdom is truly extravagant. That wood spear jade quintessence is mined from the 8,000 mile black swamp of the Sea of Miracles. The Great Smelting Prince said with a smile, The Sea of Miracles 8,000 mile black swamp? Lin Ming asked as he heard the Great Smelting Prince's words. In his mind, a strange association was forming. Brother Lin hasn't heard of the black swamp before? The Great Smelting Prince shot Lin Ming a strange look but continued to explain, The Sea of Miracles is known as being the Sea of No Return and the Ocean of Endless Storms. It is the most terrifying life-forbidden zone in the entire Sky Spill Continent. As the Great Smelting Prince spoke to here, the Seven Star Divine Kingdom High Successor also smiled, shaking his head as he added, Brother Ruit, your description of the Sea of Miracles as a life-forbidden zone is far too pale. There are many areas in the Sky Spill Continent known as life-forbidden zones, but the truth is that there are only one or two big cats within. Most of them can be handled by a mere revolving core powerhouse. As the Seven Star High Successor spoke to here, the other martial artists smiled. Indeed, to martial artists of different boundaries of strength, the definition of a life forbidden zone was also different. Old Thirdly, you don't need to interrupt me. The Great Smelting Prince said with a teasing laugh. It was obvious from his casual tone that he had a good personal friendship with the Seven Star High Successor. The Sea of Miracles is a true life forbidden zone, and also the most dangerous land in the entire Sky Spill continent, bar none. After entering deep into the Sea of Miracles, it is said that the entire sea is a lifeless, pitch black and the skies are forever covered in layers upon layers of lightning storms. It isn't an exaggeration to say that entering the Sea of Miracles is an absolute death sentence. Without exception, even Divine Sea Supreme Elders are the same. Up until now, there has never been a record of anyone ever having managed to cross the Sea of Miracles. Even the four Divine Kingdom's Divine Emperors all worship and revere the Sea of Miracles. And surrounding the entire Sea of Miracles is the 8,000 mile Black Swamp, which can also be considered as the shores of the Sea of Miracles. Because the land's topography is similar to a beach and shallow tidelands, the entire surrounding of the Sea of Miracles appears to look like a black swamp. Even though this black swamp is lower risk than the Sea of Miracles, it still isn't a place that Divine Sea Powerhouse can freely enter and leave. There are even Divine Sea Powerhouses that can perish within if their luck is poor enough. For instance, even if I were to enter into the 8,000 mile black swamp, it wouldn't matter how many magical treasures and defensive items I brought with me, I would never return. The Great Smelting Price had a self-deprecating smile as he spoke to here, but Lin Ming's heart was actually racing with emotions. This Sea of Miracles sounded exactly like the Eternal Demon Abyss. The Eternal Demon Abyss was also known as the Land of No Return. When the number one top powerhouse of the Holy Demon Continent had reached a bitter bottleneck in his cultivation, he had entered the Eternal Demon Abyss to search for a lucky chance. But, the result was that he had died there, never to return, and around the Eternal Demon Abyss was the 1,000 Mile Forbidden Zone. Although the risks were far, far lower than in the true Eternal Demon Abyss, it still wasn't a place that an Emperor-level martial artist could freely enter. Whether it was the High Lords of the Twelve Sky Split Towers or the Tower Masters themselves, none of them had even returned alive after entering the 1,000 Mile Forbidden Zone. As for Lin Ming, he had only managed to escape the 1,000 Mile Forbidden Zone by relying on the memories of a Demon Emperor as well as his own unique abilities. And listening to this Great Smelting Prince's words, the 8,000 Mile Black Swamp was extremely similar to the 1,000 Mile Forbidden Zone of the Eternal Demon Abyss. The Skill Spill Continent had the Sea of Miracles and the Holy Demon Continent had the Eternal Demon Abyss. Could this really have been a mere coincidence? As Lin Ming was thinking this, the Great Smelting Prince's next words raised even greater waves in Lin Ming's mind. He said, Every ten years, there will be a black tsunami that comes from the Sea of Miracles. Normally, the tsunami will reach out to a distance of 8,000-9,000 miles, completely covering the 8,000-mile black swamp. This black tsunami is wholly terrifying. If one is caught within, then that is certain death. But although this black tsunami is terrifying, 
there are still great advantages to be had. That is that the wood spear jade floating in the sea of miracles will rush out into the black swamp where it can be mined by others. Thus, even though the four divine kingdoms were founded over 10,000 years ago, the amount of wood spear jade resources have never fallen off, always managing to continuously replenish themselves.